Hello and welcome back my beautiful froggy army to another video. I have been totally itching to do some more random dream island tours so that's basically what we're going to be doing today. Like I don't have that much of an intro to be honest. I guess I'll just say check out my merch if you haven't already and subscribe to the channel and like this video if you like dream island tours or animal crossing or if you like cheese. If you like cheese also like this video. And don't forget to follow me on my social medias to keep up with me outside of my YouTube schedule. But honestly, I think we're just gonna get into it, I guess. So we're gonna go ahead and do surprise me. Okay, our first island is Shambhala. I hope I'm saying that correctly. Let's see what we got. It looks like this island is set in the winter time and also at night, but I'm really digging this path so far. And this little, oh my goodness, this little choir of snowmen, that is so freaking cute. Oh wait, we should we should probably look at the map. I always forget to do that. Pretty simple map, TBH, but hey, the map doesn't truly reflect everything that's going on on an island, you know? I forgot to look at the villagers, but we got some good villagers. We got Tipper, Goose, we got some chickens. This is almost kind of like a farmy island, like with Butch and Elmer and stuff. But then we have like Bianca and Apollo and Marina, but I love all these like patchy paths everywhere and these adorable little footprints in the path. Oh, oh, okay. There's, there's so many things to look at. USPS. Okay, cute. Oh, this is the airport. Okay, we found our way to the airport. There's a little sign that says to event. I want to go to an event. Hello. This is cute, whatever this is. I don't know what it is, but I, I like it. Oh, we have a little tree farm. This is so cute. It's like a Christmas tree farm. Oh my goodness. How adorable. Cut your own tree. Well, that's a mistake giving me a chainsaw. <laughs> Don't give that to me. I love this so much. That is so freaking adorable. Oh, here's Nooks. Okay. And oh, here's the post office. This is like the main office probably. And we have a little gyroid worker working at the post office. Isn't that adorable? And also disclaimer, I am going to say the words adorable and cute like 50 gazillion times in this video. I know, okay? And I don't care anymore. I'm just embracing it. And then here is Nooks with the little shopping cart and all of the little store shelves. And look at that. They've even got like a little section on the beach over here. This is so cute. Oh, and we got some construction. Oh my goodness, I love that. Extending it onto the beach. Very smart. And then we're back at the plaza. Okay, so we kind of explored like the right side. I'm gonna go over the bridge and past all of these pretty flowers. Oh, we have a lot of, we got a lot of green mums over here. <laughs> oh wow, they are really flexing. They are flexing on us so hard right now. Look, Raymond, look at all of these lily of the valleys. <laughs> I love it though. You, you gotta flex when you can, you know what I mean? We have like a little bakery. This is so cute. I love it. I, what is this item? This little like bread. How have I never seen that before? Now I really want bread. That looks like it would be like pumpkin bread or something maybe, or like some sort of like pound cake. And I want that so badly right now. Oh, they have a little farm. You know me, I love a good farm. I found the most adorable little picnic spot up on this cliff with the little hot Cheetos and the candle. So romantic, I love it. And this little floating island is super cute too with the little tree. And then we have a villager house house and they have a little farm too which is perfect. I think every single villager should have a farm. You know what I mean? We've got some stuff on the beach, some cute little like marshmallow roasting and a little like fire pit. Let me turn on these tiki torches. Let's get the let's get the flames going, you know what I mean? Okay, I can't turn these on. That's kind of awkward. The flames have been extinguished. <laughs> oh, hello. I just totally ran into you. What's up? Nothing much. Just kind of filming a YouTube video right now, but that's pretty much it. Okay, I found myself back at the front, so I'm gonna try to make my way all the way back because I think that is what I'm missing pretty much. Oh, here's Able Sisters. How did I miss this? This is so cute. Oh, wait, what is this? <laughs> There's like a feast going on over here. I want whatever all of this is. This pie? Yes. This pie? Yes. Give me all of it. Oh, this is literally right next to the plaza. I don't know how I missed this. So we have Abel's and I love using the, what are those called? Storefronts turned around as like the little walls little hanger rack and the washer and the dryer so cute and i love all the clothes on display as well that's that's something that i love to do for Abel sisters it's just such a nice touch okay yeah we never went up the incline here so we're gonna take a little look see back here what is going on over here we're gonna go inside their house and see what's inside look at this it is such a vibe in here they definitely have like an aesthetic look at that it's so so sleek so modern 
so cute oh my goodness look at this wait is this a custom design like little fireplace that is so cool i have never thought to do that ever in my life i don't think i've ever seen that before i'm seeing new things here new ideas uh let's go in the back i want to see what's back here oh wow look at this they made like a whole balcony i love when people do this this is so awesome there's like a little kitchen over here and we've got lots of seating and street lamps this is such a vibe. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Why is this like so nice? I don't know. Oh, and that wallpaper choice is also super nice. Okay, let's go back. I want to see the rest of what's in this house because now I'm getting really excited. The next room we have is a little bedroom and this is also such a cozy vibe. The adorable little like quilted bed looks so cozy. The little quilted armchair, the mood lighting. I love it in here and like the freaking cutout in the back wall like look at that that is so stunning <laughs> i love that so much oh my goodness the custom designs that they must have devoted just to make this wall in particular must have been crazy but i'm here for it oh my goodness is this just a lonely toilet back here <gasps> a toilet hallway i love it so much oh my goodness look at this kitchen this is also so cozy. That is like this island in a nutshell is just so cozy. This little rug. I swear I've never seen that rug before. The little windows. Oh my goodness, this is so precious. This is just, this feels like such a homey, cozy little kitchen. What the heck? Like I would literally live here. Like, just put me in the microwave. I will live here. That's my home now. I think the kitchen has been my favorite so far, but we have one more room to go, so we'll see. Oh, wow. Okay. Well, you know, this might be my favorite room. I see some cows. So this looks like a farm, question mark, I believe. Um, We've got like the little cows. We've got the stables over here oh my goodness we've got like little duckies the the layouts of these rooms are just like so 1000 iq i don't know how people come up with this stuff like i would never be able to think of this the player house was really really good like i feel like that was probably one of the best parts of the island that was so nice so yeah i think i've seen pretty much everything here so once again, I will show you the map. This is Shambhala and the dream address is down there at the bottom. If you would like to tour it, it is right there for you. So yeah, thank you so much for letting me visit random person, even though you didn't let me use a random dream tour, but I'm gonna skedaddle now. But this was really, really nice. Such a cozy island. We are here on Monaco and we're gonna see what the island has to offer. I'm gonna take a little look-see around. Oh my goodness, what is this? <laughs> this is this little train? That is so cute. Oh, the flag is really cute too. I like that. I'm gonna go south. I like this little border of roses, golden roses and little lights and Punchy's out here with the frog umbrella. Hey, Punchy. So right off the bat, they have like this sidewalk and road pathway, which just anyone who uses these custom designs, huge props because I feel like it's such a pain to cover your whole island floor with these. They have like a little waiting area here and that is super cute. And over here, we've got like the ATMs and the and the telephones and stuff. There's a little pipe. I'm gonna see where this leads me. <gasps> what is this? I have no clue where we are right now, but I am digging it. I feel like this is probably like a, a forced perspective kind of thing. And we're gonna have some good view somewhere else. So let me go back and I, I wanna find this section later. <laughs> okay, okay, focus Raven. Let's go back and I wanna see what's over here. We have like a little cafe area, very cute. Look at how cute this is. Oh my goodness, like the little bar area where you can just like sit and have some ramen. This looks so good. Look at the custom designs on the back as well. And we've even got cars in the street, a little bike parking area. Wow, look at the look at all the cars. Oh my goodness, it is a busy packed street today. And look at these freaking bridges. Look at this. <laughs> Why is this so good? I love this. Oh wait, we didn't even look at the map. Hold on one sec. This is a very, very simple map. And look at all the villager houses all on the beach. Interesting. So we have our campsite over here. Looks like a pretty simple campsite in the middle of the city, which I totally get. You know, you want to keep it simple. Look at all the scooters. <laughs> and we even have like pedestrians crossing over here. Oh my goodness. This is so like 
I don't know, like spaced out nicely. And look at this. We have a little fishing area with these creepy, terrifying crabs. I hate those so much. <laughs> they are absolutely terrifying. No, not another one. <laughs> Get me out. Oh, but even though the villager houses are on the beach, they still do have somewhat of some stuff going on for them. They're all... Look at all of that. They're all monochrome. Really interesting. And look at all of these Lily of the Valleys. <laughs> they are flexing on us real hard right here. <laughs> I'm having trouble deciding where I want to go next. I guess let's go up by the cars. Zoom in past the cars. Beep beep. We have a little farmer's market off the road over here. Look at this. All of the areas, I feel like they have plenty of space. You know what I mean? Like there's so many stalls and everything is like perfectly on theme with all the colors and everything oh i see the carousel back there i want to see what that is so not a lot of terraforming on this island um which makes sense you know it's kind of like more of a city here's our little carnival cute here's the player house and it looks like we even have a little garage on the side that's so cute we have a little island back there with like a farm and everything I see that section we were at. I want to get to there. How do we get to there? <laughs> Look at this diagonal bridge. I love it. I absolutely love pointless bridges. So I can't seem to make my way back there, but off in the distance, you can see the little section where the pipe spawned us and the little two fighting robots that are kind of in the back here. So they're kind of having a showdown over there. We've got like a little parking garage slash gas station over here full of cars. And I think I saw Abel's. Over here, yes, we have Abel sisters, and here is our player. Hello, welcome. Thank you so much. Wearing that the Gucci, <laughs> I like the little duck pond. That is really cute, and we have some fishies. And look at all of this. Oh, this is the museum. Okay, this makes sense. All of these cool artifacts by the museum. We also have a basketball court. Oh, nice. I'm terrible at basketball. <laughs> Ooh, what's down there? How do I get over there? Look at this adorable little pathway with all of these lights. This is so cute. How picturesque. Adorable. We have like a little pizza restaurant. I'm gonna sit and I'm gonna eat a little bit of pizza. Don't mind me. Ooh, then down here we have like a little movie theater area, movie watching area on the beach with some of these villager houses. But yeah, I think that's pretty much it. I was pretty quick touring all of it because honestly it's a mostly flat island and I was able to just run around everywhere quickly and the paths are laid out so nicely that I can just easily access everywhere. So this was a really cool like kind of j slightly Japanese inspired city of Monaco. So there's a dream address if you would like to check it out. This was really fun. Um, I do appreciate a good city core island and this one was executed so nicely. So thank you so much for having me. So our next island is called the Shire and I'm very curious if this is going to be Hobbit slash Lord of the Rings themed. I already see the little flag is the iconic door. So very interested here. So going south of the plaza, we have this super cute little like corner area with this little bridge and the little waterfall. This is so magical. Oh my goodness. And like the, is this sunset or early morning on this island? I can't tell. I'm gonna say early morning. <laughs> but that sky is so pretty and I just love it so much. So let's see, can we find the airport? Is it this way? Oh, this mailbox. Oh, we saw this on an island that we looked at earlier. That's so funny. Uh, we've got like a little beach area. Oh my goodness, Maple is over there on the bridge. <gasps> She's so cute. Oh my goodness, wait, the map, the map. We can't forget about the map. Oh, this is such a cute little map. I love the little neighborhood that we're in right now and just like all the pathing and everything. That looks super cute. So here's kind of like the neighborhood. Like I said, we have all the houses kind of like lined up together, which is really adorable. And everybody has like their own yard. I love that. Behind resident services, we have like a little record shop and like a little coffee shop. I love this balloon so much. And over here, look at this little like cafe. This is so cute. I love these simple panels and cutouts and everything. This just feels so nice. Oh, this is like a little winery. Okay, cute, cute. And then we have nooks as well. Really cute. Love the touch of like these little boxes. And going down here, we've got a little plant shop. Love me a good plant shop. Absolutely, absolutely. Is this the public pool? Oh my goodness, I love this. I love this so much. Oh wait, we can lay down in the pool. Hold on, hold on, we can float, we can float. Look at me go. 
look at me go that is iconic i love it and like the little cabanas like they made the little cabanas with like the gazebos and the curtains that's so smart that's so smart and then back here we have kind of like a zen garden wow oh my goodness no not the sushi stop putting the fish in front of the sushi bar no the poor fishies <laughs> and then we have a little farm with these little rams little sheepies that is so cute and like a little little train over there with like a little train station and a little windmill look at these little oh my goodness i forget what these are called but i know they're from zelda question mark i don't really play zelda games so i'm not quite sure but this little campsite area is look at how magical this is the hyacinth lamps the little lilies of the valleys the mushrooms the butterflies this is this is vibes this is straight up vibes right here this is absolutely gorgeous and stunning even this little pine cone i'm gonna i'm gonna pick it up i'm gonna eat it later and you can't stop me and a look at this super cute little peninsula build with the lighthouse and the little bunnies and the duck that is so sweet i absolutely love that and then look at this freaking rainbow garden oh my goodness i love me a good rainbow garden so this is like super satisfying honestly oh what do we have on the beach a little camper this is so cute look at how adorable this is I would literally live there. I would literally live in that bus and not care about life's worries or taxes or anything. Okay, so going back up the little butterfly path, I'm gonna go up this incline because I feel like there's a bunch of stuff up here and we have this beautiful view. Look at this. I'm pretty sure that's the museum in the back there. That is so stunning with like the pink flowers up on that cliff. So cute. We have like a little apiary. I love me a good apiary with like the bees and everything. And what do we have back here? We have a little orchard. I love the fruits being everywhere. Hi, Judy. Judy, why are you going towards the chainsaw? Yeah, walk away, walk away. Mm -hmm. We've got more of the orchard down below and we even have like a little fruit station, little melon farm. This is so cute. I, Again, I love these ladders that they put in orchards sometimes. I like need to go throw one in my orchard right now because it's so smart. And also the little like movie projector movie night thing is so cute. I, I love that too. Okay, now I'm gonna go to the right and we have this beautiful walkway into the player house let's go ahead and see what's inside oh the inside is so cute why do i why do all of these islands have like the best interiors <laughs> meanwhile my dream address has like a completely empty house with like roaches and random trash on the floor oh my goodness i absolutely love this bathroom i am such a sucker for this like steamy floor and they made like the perfect little shower stall with the curtains oh my goodness this is like literally 1 million iq right here <laughs> and then we have like an office this is so cute oh my goodness look at all the villager pictures <laughs> i'm gonna assume it's someone's birthday or something we've got balloons and little balloon arch that is so cute and then we've got like more pictures on the side this is just such a sweet little office i love it and then we have a little bedroom up here and okay there's so many little details about this that i just love they made a freaking balcony which you know that i love balconies we saw one in like the last um one of the last dream tours that we did but like this is just this is so good i just can never think of these things with like the pillars and the columns and stuff like that and I feel like just other people have so many big juicy brain ideas, but I love like the sunglasses on the wall. It looks very like chic and the little like bouquet on the side table is also super cute. Such a nice little like touch. That was a really cute house. I, I really enjoyed that, 10 out of 10. So now we have like a whole field of bugs. Oh my goodness. And look at this little garage so cute but i think all we're missing is the museum so i'm gonna skedaddle on over and try to find the museum i think it is right back this way okay so we have like a little gift shop first of all which is just so cute <laughs> i love the little fossil shirt and the fossil hats that is so adorable and we also have a freaking rainbow garden in front of the museum which 
beautiful. You can never have too many. I like it. I like this little <laughs> dinosaur like picture taking spot in front of the green screen. That's really smart. So yeah, I think that's pretty much it. That has been the Shire. It was not as Hobbit inspired as I thought it was going to be, but it was still a stunning island and I really, really liked it. So definitely check it out if you would like to. The dream address is right there for you. I think that's going to be all for today's video. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you want to see more random dream island tours, please give this video a like and let me know that you liked it and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss next time I post one. Thank you so much again for watching and I will see you in the next one.